We've never had a golden that was anxious or fearful until we got Winnie. Winnie, why are you hiding behind the trash can? What's wrong? <laughs> In the beginning, we noticed that she was just afraid of most noises. What do you hear, Pooh Bear? Like, let's go to the dog parks. Let's go do all the dog things. And she just hated everything that we tried. She would just start getting closer for comfort. We adopted Winnie when I was seven months pregnant. But when we had our baby, we noticed something. Winnie's anxiety was practically gone. She was just so patient with him. Whenever guests would come over to see the baby, Winnie would be monitoring the whole interaction. And she would even do that to me. I would be feeding the baby and she's just sitting over me, judging me. We moved into our new house and opened up our in-home daycare. That was the magic moment for us. As soon as we opened daycare, that's when she really became Nana. She just really came out of her shell. She will bring me my baby's diapers. Thank you. Thank you. You take this to the baby? And she'll also bring my baby's bottle too. Okay, let's go. She's just a huge help to have around. During nap time, she stays in the room with them. I don't make her, the door's open, it's just where she wants to be. And the kids prefer it anyways too. They prefer that someone stays with them and they always ask it to be Nana. All of the parents think it's just the sweetest thing when she does that. The kids benefit from Nana so much, whether they're playing salon, or doctor, or they're on the trampoline, or doing crafts. She's just the center of it all. Winnie has a heart condition that limits her exercise. Daycare's been so special for us because it's the first thing that we noticed that has made Winnie happy while allowing her just to stay calm and be herself. If I had to describe Nana in a few words, I would describe her as motherly, empathetic, and unique. She's just not like any other dog that I've ever met.